Welcome back. Every year, 65,000 people die in the U.S. from antibiotic-resistant infections. It is a serious problem that is not just affecting adults. In tonight's Baby Your Baby report, Mary Nichols explains when children should and should not take antibiotics and the risk if they are taken at the wrong time. Antibiotic resistance is a real thing that we are dealing with. Usually when a child is sick, it's due to a viral infection, and antibiotics simply do not work against viruses. Too often we've conditioned the population to think that every time we're sick we need an antibiotic, and that's not true. Taking an antibiotic when it's not appropriate will not help kids get better. All it will do is increase the risk of the medicine being ineffective when it's actually needed. The antibiotics we prefer to use in children are really quite limited. So it's even a bigger problem with children with antibiotic resistance than it is in adults. As a parent, it's important when your child visits the doctor to not have preconceived ideas of how they should be treated. It would be helpful if parents didn't come in asking for an antibiotic. Instead, prepare for the appointment by asking questions. Ask the question, are you sure my child needs an antibiotic when the doctor gives them one? And if your child is sick with a bacterial infection, don't be afraid if they need to take an antibiotic. That's when they're intended to be used. Certainly there are things that do require antibiotics, and we are more than happy to give your child an antibiotic for those things. Mary Nichols, 2 News.